First of all, let's set up the DR60. Turn the unit over to access the battery compartment on the back. Remove cover. Extend the ribbon over the battery cage and place the left hand battery in first to make it easier to remove them when finished. It's recommended to use alkaline batteries rather than rechargeables with the DR60 as it's quite power hungry. Hold the power button down for three seconds to turn on. Set the time and date if asked. Use the scroll wheel to cycle through the numbers and then the forward button to move to the next number. Once complete, pressing the scroll wheel will confirm. The first thing to do is to reset the recorder and format the memory card. Press menu, scroll down using the wheel to others, click the wheel to select it. Scroll to system, Choose Initialize to reset to factory settings. Choose Quick Format to clear the SD card, each time pressing the wheel for Enter. Press Menu to go back or use the Stop key which acts as the Home key. Let's look at the inputs on the DR60. Inputs 1 and 2 are XLR or quarter inch combined inputs for mics and lines. Inputs 3 and 4 is a stereo mini jack input. Camera in being used to monitor the sound returning from a camera, with camera out is used to send a feed from the DR60 to a camera. On the other side of the DR60 we have headphone port, the line out port with an output level dial, hold switch, power button, and the USB port and SD card slot are under the rubber flap.